Hey guys, so welcome to Silicon Valley Girl. Today we're gonna make an inspection. We're gonna go to the Whole Foods store first and uh, get things that I would normally get for myself for a week. And then we're gonna go to Trader Joe's and get the same products there. And then we're gonna compare the experience and prices. So if you're interested, continue watching this video. says that's a bad one. We're picking a better, better card. This one's good? No, this is bad. <laughs> the art of picking. Organic strawberries, $8.99. We're getting a lot more again than we got at Whole Foods, but that's the only option we can get here. $8.99. Blueberries, non-organic, but that's the only uh, blueberries we could find right now. $6.99 per package. Organic blueberries, we're getting a lot more than we got um, in Whole Foods. Because we're just doing a lot of berries today, let's do blackberries they're by the way my favorite again we're looking at their quality these are leaking a little let's do maybe those the ones that are closer to the refrigerator are normally better I like to shop for berries and fresh produce myself um, I could order everything online through Amazon because Amazon acquired Whole Foods so you could order everything online for free, free to our delivery, but whenever you order stuff online, they're gonna bring you the worst. Yesterday we ordered some fish because we wanted to make fish steaks and we got three uh, fish tails. And then if you're ordering avocados, you're gonna get green ones. If you're ordering bananas, you will probably get the greenest bananas out there. So I prefer to go and shop for the stuff myself. Organic navel oranges, best juice is made of them. Avocados, four pieces, $3.99. Organic avocados for oh my god, they're like stones By the way guys whole trade banana 69 organic whole trade banana 69 whole trade banana 49 I wonder if you could taste the difference for the purity of this experiment, I'm taking organic stuff and I prefer organic and uh, I can really taste the difference. So whenever possible, we're picking organic stuff. Organic Honeycrisp Apple Bag, three pounds. Organic Honeycrisp Apples. Organic yellow onion, $1.99 per pound. We're gonna take two. Time for some broccoli, $2.49 organic. Organic broccoli to go. Organic One ninety nine. Mint organic. There are no 
bunches. Mini Persian cucumbers, $3.99. Organic. Organic Persian cucumbers, $2.69. Baby Bella sliced mushrooms, $3.49. Organic white mushrooms. One of the reasons to visit Trader Joe's is their smoked salmon. It tastes um, as if it was a Finnish salmon and this is something that I really, really miss about Finland. Their salmon is the best, but this one is also great. They don't have a price tag, but we'll uh, we'll see at the at the checkout how much it costs. They've got the same brand as Whole Foods, and it is thirteen ninety nine. Get two yogurts. Oh, that looks good. Let's do coconut cream. Okay, that's the only oat milk they have here in Trader Joe's. Not the best, but I guess we're comparing things. Large brown X for $4.99. Breakfast granola. I love, love, love Trader Joe's for its um, granola offerings. They have like the best granola that everyone keeps recommending me toasted coconut granola. I'm gonna go for this one. It's organic toasted coconut granola bark. The total from Whole Foods, $84.75. The total from Trader Joe's, $69.65. And here um, I have my Amazon discount. But a couple of things to consider. First, um, if you compare portions and packages that you get from Trader Joe's, they're actually bigger than those that you get in Whole Foods. Two, when we started trying food, when we started trying berries, for example, strawberries from Whole Foods have much more flavor than strawberries from Trader Joe's. And I would say, generally speaking, fresh produce is worse in Trader Joe's compared to Whole Foods. But you really need to be picky, as I taught you, as my mom taught me, pick the best stuff. Third, it's really all about convenience because the difference in price is two Uber rides if you're in San Francisco uh, or maybe it's your time that's valuable. So I would still prefer a grocery store that's closer to my house, uh, which is now Whole Foods. But the thing is, I used to order Whole Foods through Amazon, which has free to our delivery. But now because of all the things that are happening, uh, you can't find any available delivery slots. So I would just um, go to a grocery store that's um, next door and uh, do all the shopping myself. Please let me know in comments below how you're coping with the current situation in your country or in your city and how do you get uh, your groceries? Uh, what's going on? Do you get them delivered or do you do the shopping yourself? Let me know down in comments below and uh, I will see you very soon in the next vlogs that will probably be from home. By the way, look at the wall. Uh, I just uh, remade it for the purpose of making more videos um, in front of it. I just want this wall to be more exciting to look at because I'm going to be sitting in front of it for weeks, I guess. See you soon. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and smash the like button.